Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, here is another haul with the domain, except this one is pretty outstanding. I try and, you know, uh, make everything look as exciting as possible, but this one is really crazy. What's inside here I, is like, I, I've had a look inside and I still can't believe my eyes. This is a parcel that I received from Canada. To the best of my knowledge, this is directly from one of the Mega Constructs warehouses. When you see what's inside, there's no reason why it wouldn't be. So, we're gonna crack this open today. It's got some Amazon labels on it, so clearly this was an Amazon box at one point in its life. But now it's filled to the brim with Halo. And this is my craziest blind bag haul ever. Give it away. Yeah, was that a spoiler? All right. Oh my gosh, I'm like, I'm, I'm honestly very excited about this. Background, I found a guy on eBay. I bought 10 sealed cyan Spartans from him, which you can see in one of my target hauls. I showed it off in the car. And then I asked him if he had anything else. And he just started sending me sealed boxes of like factory product from Mega. So, whoo this is crazy. This is crazy. All right, the first blind bag in this box is a 2016 Flame Marine. Every year back in the day, Mega Constructs would go to things like San Diego Comic Con, New York Toy Fair, New York Comic Con, all sorts of different events, including Bloxfest, my gaming convention in the UK. And they would always design a figure for each year to give out, sometimes more than one figure. This is the collectible from 2016, the Flame Marine, and it's pretty iconic. It has a gold flamethrower, which ties into the 10th anniversary of Mega Constructs. All of the figures in the 10th anniversary sets all had gold weapons and it's also iconic because the flame marine was reintroduced into mega it was one of the very first figures that they ever made back in like 2009 and then they took a pause on the mold and they brought it back here so a really iconic figure we're gonna tear it open right now i don't care try and stop me it's actually made of like a weird plastic this uh, this bag come on out friend there we are. I am currently building up a supply of very rare figures. One of my aims this year is to make a video where I unbox every blind bag that's been given away at events from Mega Blocks, Mega Constructs, like all of them. Inside the instruction manual is the tube for the flamethrower. They just didn't want it to get damaged, I guess. I hope this shows off some of the upcoming sets from the year. There we go, yeah. We've got a Yankee Squad. We've got a Gauss Hog with a couple of Halo 5 Guardian Spartans and the Halo Halo 5 Wraith. That Wraith is one thing I still don't own, but it does come with a really nice couple of Silver Elites and a Hell Jumper, so I should try and add it to my collection at some point. There's our 2016 exclusive Flame Marine. Ah, beautiful. So let's build it up, shall we? Blind bag openings particularly are what I really enjoy doing. I have a video that I've been editing for quite a long time. I actually keep on, every time I make a video, I keep on promising that this video is going to come out. I've said, hey, it's gonna come out tomorrow, the blind bag video, watch out for it. I I did that in yesterday's video. It's just a really long episode to edit, so I've still not finished it. That's why I'm releasing this video today, just still not finished my big blind bag project. I also have my Halo Heroes project that I filmed back in Hong Kong, and that's almost finished. So this Flame Marine does look fantastic, and the best feature that I've just noticed is on his helmet. He's got this gray color running around the tubing of his like oxygen mask. So that's really dope. Pop that on. The rest is just a plain blue base and gray secondary limbs and armor. Ah, oh, the whole thing is beautiful. There's a little bit of plastic wear on the chest there, but it's not a big issue. Like I put together so many old school flamethrowers when they first came out. So it's really beautiful to see one of these, especially in gold and for like, you know, an event exclusive. Very, very special. Look at that, really nice. The gold flamethrower matches his visor. He's got a little sort of a speckled display stand. And he is the 2016 event exclusive Mega Constructs product. You may be wondering, Simon, if you bought that, why did you open it? Because it's a rare figure. Why wouldn't you keep that sealed? Funny thing you should say that. <laughs> The next blind bag on our list is the, oh, the 2016 exclusive Flame Marine. Well, I got two of them, that's really nice. If you would like to win this 2016 exclusive Flame Marine, just comment down below saying blind bag hype, and I'll choose one of you to win this. And if you are also commenting down below, please do make sure to like this video and subscribe with that bell on. So we got a blind bag Flame Marine, that's pretty cool. All right, next figure, uh, blind bag 2016 Flame Marine. Blind bag Flame Marine, blind bag Flame Marine. Blind bag, blind, oh no. Blind bag, 
I can't actually do it. Blind bag flame marine. 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 Blind bag. Blind bag flame marine. It's it's the blind bag flame marine. It's the blind bag flame marine. It's the blind bag flame marine. Look, guys. Look, guys. Look, guys. It's the blind bag flame marine. Guys, look. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow. That was uh, that was really fun. Tell me now that I am not the mega constructs god. <laughs> yes. I think I lost one, didn't I? Oh no, I lost two. This is, believe it or not, 50 2016 Mega Constructs Blind Bag Flame Marine. And they did originally come in the factory sealed box. I asked him to take them out of the box so we could condense and save shipping from Canada. Man. Smells like... Comic-Con. Smells like sweaty men. <laughs> All right, well, uh, that's the whole, folks. See you next time. Just kidding. Let's move these aside. This guy can guard the army. The army lays dormant. And now we're gonna move on to the next event. This is my craziest blind bag haul because I would classify all of these as blind bags. The next ones up is something really cool. This is the 2010 Cyan Spartan, limited edition, given away at the very first Mega Constructs events that they attended. This was actually given away at the very first Blocks Fest as well. Every attendee got one of these. So really special, dual wield magnums, just like your favorite Spartan Palmer. Then on the back, we've got the Arctic Rocket Hog versus Ghost. We've got the Gremlin, the old school Gauss Hog versus Locust, the Covenant Wraith with Orange Hayabusa, the Arctic Wolverine with Purple Hunter, the Turret versus Mongoose, that was my first ever set, and the Chopper versus Turret. It's just so iconic. They're like the first set. So very special to see them all on one piece of packaging. This is basically like the second wave. The first ever wave was the Warthog, and I think the Mongoose was also in the first wave, but damn, that is so cool. This is a Science Spartan, and the story behind this is pretty funny. I bid on a lot of 20 of these, and then I got outbid, and I was like, okay, I don't wanna bother with this. Later on, I bid on a lot of 10, which you saw me unbox. I received those, I won the bid, I got 10 of them. Then I got a notification, which was really weird. I've never seen this before, and it said, the previous bid on your item was retracted. You are now the highest bidder. So I'd already won 10 of these. The guy who had outbid me on the 20 of these the day before lost his bid, it was retracted somehow. So as well as the 10, I won 20 more. Oh no, where you go? Oh man. No, no person is meant to have this many Cyan Spartans, but I'm still grateful for it. There is also a rumor that I'm sort of playing with at the minute. I'm going to unbox it on a different video, but I have a theory that there are two different Cyan Spartans. They have two different codes, A16 and A28, so I believe they might actually be different. Either way, we're gonna have a look inside, and I wanna be very careful taking this tape off. This is a really, really rare item, one of the rarest single figures Megas made, as well as the Cyan Spartan, there was the Steel Spartan, and the unknown one that most people don't know about, the Teal Spartan. Here we go, boys. This is a piece of history. Whoa, the Cyan Spartan. Honestly, like, the production value of this compared to, like, more recent figures is way, way better. I'm gonna be taking this out of its packaging in a future video and hopefully comparing the two colors side by side. So currently we have 50 of these Flame Marines and 20 of these Cyan Spartans, plus another 10 that I have uh, in a different house. And you can also win one of these. I'm giving six of these away in the Christmas Toymation Fest. Check out the video on my channel on the Christmas Toymation Fest. Create an animation and finish it, submit it by the end of January, and you could win one of these. You'd think we'd be done, but we're really not. What do we have in here? Uh, wait, <laughs> that, that's a spoiler. What do we have in here? It says, Mega Inventory, December 2015. You tell me this is not from the Mega Warehouse, I swear. It's crazy. So this is a full case of a blind bag series, and it's actually my favorite blind bag series. So maybe you already know what it is. Terra Ultima Doom might know. This is a full case of 24 blind bags of Bravo series. 
<laughs> wow, look at this. Bravo series. This is, in my opinion, uh, the best blind bag series there is. It's just as the elites were given new articulation, so you have that dope ranger. But then the star of the show, of course, is the Flood Combat Form and Guilty Spark. That's a really legendary duo, and that comes in one blind bag. We've got the NMPD officer and the Halo 2 trooper. We've even got a red skirmisher. Like, this is so sick. The fact that it's a sealed box of 24 makes me think that the chase figures are still going to be intact. Because here's the thing, when you buy blind bags nowadays on eBay, they've already been coded. They're not going to be the flood, they're not going to be the ACs, they're not going to be the chase figures, like, they'll all have been taken out. But this gives me hope that we're actually going to get a really rare figure. I think I'm gonna do a full Bravo series opening. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do yet. Leave a comment down below what you want me to do with these. Do you want me to code them and open some, or do you want me to just give them all away, am I right? <laughs> okay, and another really cool feature of this is you can see these two boxes are made for each other. Look at that. They have these cardboard tabs. I've never seen this before. Cardboard tabs that slot into the top of this one and create one big display box. Companies have the choice, they could tear off the tabs and they could put two of them separately on the shelf or they could keep them together. And yes, that's 12 per half box. So 12, 12, 24 makes a full case. You guys might look at a video and be like, oh, you called this the craziest blind bag haul ever. That's clickbait, is it? Like, <laughs> is it 50 of these guys, 20 of these, and 24 of these? Thank you very much for tuning in today, guys. I hope you uh, <laughs> got as excited as I did from this haul. This is pretty outrageous. Comment down below with blind bag hype to win one of these flame marines. Then check back for upcoming videos where I'm going to open one of every exclusive San Diego Comic Con or New York Toy Fair figure. A video where I unbox two of these properly. Maybe a video where I open every single one of the Bravo series. I'm definitely going to open all of those Flood and Guilty Sparks, let me tell you that much. Check back every single day for a new video. We are going to upload every day of 2022. You stay awesome, you stay safe out there, folks. And the outrageous blind bag haul is signing off.